seven minutes uh, past seven. That's our time on Sarifem sounding good all the time. And uh, it is the second segment on the spot. I mean, of, on the on the spot in the tw- year 2023, the most hidden and trending show in the land. Yesterday, I hosted actor and a few makers, Zolile Makeleni, um, uh, known as uh, Tsotsi from the drama series Wenera. You can check that on uh, on our Facebook page as well, as well as my um, YouTube channel. Uh, today, I'm hosting one of the most controversial hip hop sensation. Uh, he calls himself the leader of the youth, the speaker of the truth, and advocate for the girl child. I'm talking about the CEO of Samanyanga Sounds, Mount Award winning rapper and songwriter born Mukuze Chitsama, is Holy Ten, <laughs> affectedly known uh, as the king of Zim hip hop. My guy, welcome to the show, Holy Ten. Oh, yo. <laughs> oh, yo. Oh, yo. I'm here. You're here. I'm here. Yeah, just to remind our, our listeners that uh, we are now live on uh, Stifem Facebook page as well as my page as well at DJ Ola 7 Stifem. So how are you doing, uh, Holy Ted? I'm good, bro. How are you doing? I'm doing great. Uh, yeah, what's up with your voice? <laughs> I, I, I like the voice. You like the voice? I like the voice. Uh. Each time I listen to your voice, when I'm driving, I'm listening to the music, I'm like, what? <laughs> mm. yeah, is, it, is, it, is it like the, the, your original voice or e- e- voice of craft? Yeah, voice graft. Voice, I want a voice graft, you know. Right. Yeah. No, but then triple live and yeah, triple live. You like your voice. Mm. You like my voice. Yeah. You like it right now. I, I like it. It's, does it sound nice? It sounds nice. Crispy. Crispy. Easy. <laughs> yes, yeah, man. Yes, yeah. I was so born first, like that. Yeah, great. Oh, born like that. So, uh, first, I'd like to uh, to say compliments of the uh, new season and happy belated birthday. Thank you so much, my brother. How did you enter twenty twenty three? Uh, 2023, I was asleep and I was ready for some action. And I got to get a little bit of 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 a little bit um, I was everywhere in Harare. Mm-hmm. The Akambo in the Kuma Avenues. Mm-hmm. I'm going to go to I'm going to Mount Pleasant. Switch, switch. Yeah. Uh, you started recording music at the age of 18 uh was that uh uh time the time you re- you discovered uh your talent or what uh I, I feel like the talent has always been storytelling mm-hmm. and that's what i discovered when i was still in primary mm-hmm. school mm-hmm. Uh, so when i started uh, liking hip-hop music yeah. can, I, can i try it through this way because mm-hmm. i don't want to lie to you uh, the kind of talent that i believe that i have the music, the doctor, and the So, when you have a gift, you just need to discover how do I channel it yeah. uh, to help the people. Mm. So, I found hip hop and I was comfortable there, and that's why I'm doing hip hop. Yeah, that's powerful. Initially, you'd express yourself uh, through poetry and um, uh, drama. How did you then uh, get into hip hop? Um, like I said, I was listening to music. Mm-hmm. So Muku discovered music as I was growing up in the hip hop mm-hmm. and I was comfortable there. And when I was imitating what they were doing, mm-hmm. I was listening to my storytellers. There are a lot of uh, artists that are out there. Yeah. Uh, my influence uh, made me imitate what they're doing. And mm-hmm. when I did imitate, I like, oh, no, we enjoy. Mm-hmm. And then that's that's why I'm here. Lovely. And you rose to fame around uh, about 2020 with the song Ndare Mirwa. Yes. Would you say uh, that was your breakthrough? Yes. Yes, I would say that was the, the song that made the people start looking at me. Mm, say, yeah. who, who is Holy Ten? Who is this who guy? Who is this kid? Yeah. <laughs> who is he? Yeah. And in an interview with, uh, I mean, you did with the ZCN, Mm. Uh, you mentioned that uh, your father would come, you know, into your room and say, "Ndoma pisa must be guy," you know, <laughs> meaning he wasn't in agreement uh, with what you were doing uh, then. Uh, but you didn't stop. Wasn't that um, a sign of disrespecting your parents? Uh, well, I, I don't know about disrespect, but what I'm gonna say is mm-hmm. this: uh, it's about knowledge. Yeah. Because the same father that you're talking about mm. right now would say, "Good, my son, I am very proud of you." Mm-hmm. It's about the knowledge around Rama mm-hmm. So it's upon us, the youth and those that are trying all these things. These things have never been done before. Yeah. I'm not even bitter towards mm-hmm. my father about mm-hmm. trying to burn my speakers. Yes. But uh, realistically speaking, mm-hmm. uh, music could have drowned me. So I don't, I don't blame him. He mm-hmm. didn't understand. Mm-hmm. So in the time, you could gather all that knowledge that I have to have 
around the music. Yeah. And the is news running watch won't be a mau kunisha. Bagu zinzuisi sa. Makuita noise. Makuita noise. Now that you are recognized as one of the best rappers in Zimbabwe. If, Not I mean, one of the best rappers in Zimbabwe. Yeah. The best rapper in Zimbabwe. In Zimbabwe. Please say that, Craig. In Zimbabwe. Yes. Please. Okay. <laughs> uh, have they finally uh, accepted your hustle? My parents are good. Yes, they are. Okay. In, in in the social uh media streets you have been, you know, crowned the king of uh Zim hip hop. And uh, some actually call you uh, Zimbabwe's Kanye West, you know. <laughs> Do you agree that you're king uh, you're the king of uh hip hop and our very own Kanye? Uh I believe that I am the king of Zim hip hop. <laughs> I believe that I am the king of Zimbabwean music as a whole. Mm -hmm. Yes. I I stand as the biggest and the best artist mm. in Zimbabwe. But you 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 came with an astana, you came with an and I'm you uh how did you then uh, surpass those guys who say you were uh, the king? Because that's why Zimsek is you know set up this year. Mm -hmm. He also set up for the next year. Because this year you gotta prove, mm -hmm. next year you gotta prove. Mm -hmm. And if, we were not gonna just stand by some ideology. You gotta prove. Yeah. And I've been writing tests, exams, mm -hmm. and I am the king of music in mm -hmm. the world. Mm, the king of music. The king of music. Not hip hop. All of the music. <laughs> also, including Sungura. Sungura, I'm talking. I'm a piano can I record everything. <laughs> so what are you saying about Babashero? Well, Babashero is the king of Sungura. What are you saying about him? Like I told you, yeah. They set an exam this year, uh -huh. and they set another one next year. Mm. And it, yeah, we, just because we're winning, we're at number one this year doesn't mean we were getting number one last year on a bus. Okay. Uh, so we're not trapping me into saying good and Baba Shira on a bus. Yeah. Yes. I'm saying good the king of music at the moment. Diwe. Is Holy Ten. <laughs> so who named you Holy Ten? Uh, I named myself Holy Ten. <laughs> <laughs> I can go here. If holy. I'm trying to figure out Holy. Then what's, what's with, the, with the number? Is it the number 10 or something? 10. 10 yeah. over 10. 10 over 10? Yeah, it's basic. Wow. And there's a new talent born uh, every day. You know, that's Zikungo Uya every day. Yeah. And mm. I must say, I'm not going to be in the industry. Mm. Uh, don't you feel like uh, the heat or pressure? Uh, no, I don't feel any pressure. Mm -hmm. yeah, I actually feel like uh, if there are any other people that are out there, Vadiki, uh, Vadikuda, inspiration, mm -hmm. they should probably try to get my number as soon as possible so that I can help them mm -hmm. uh, walk towards the glory and destiny. <laughs> How do you remain afloat? I mean, there is a, a stiff competition out there. Yeah. Mm -hmm. How do you remain afloat? I don't, I, I don't lie to myself. Mm. I don't lie to myself. You see these boys that I have here. Mm. Uh, me, me, I'm always there. And do not and mm -hmm. All those people are. Panang na friend yung kana one. There might be a photographer there. There's an audio engineer. Mm. There's one of the guys I ask about my lyrics. There's a dancer. There's. I don't rely on my own wisdom. Mm -hmm. And patos doska pa front. Mm -hmm. Yeah. You need to listen to, to listen people, to your people. You are a good listener. I am a good listener. Mm. Yes. That's powerful. And uh, you call yourself the leader of the youth. Yes. Why do you call yourself that? Uh, I call myself the leader of the youth because I have the confidence to say some of the things that the people can't say. Like what? Uh, uh, and I said youth for a specific reason. Mm. There are things that um, you like highlighting. Uh, things that seem like general problems yeah. that affect everybody. Mm -hmm. But there are things that we go through as the youth. Mm -hmm. and yeah. That's why here and there you hear mm -hmm. there are things that these parents don't know about mm -hmm. that the youth do. And there's got to be someone that knows about mm. these things that needs to talk about. So I'm saying I'm the leader of the youth and i got to be there for all the youth in mm. that space. That mm. space that you don't know. Mm -hmm. You don't know anything about that space. Yeah. Yeah. But we do. Okay. Yeah. Could it be political as well? No, it's not political. Not even political? It's not even political. Yeah. As the leader of the youth, yeah. what role are you playing in empowering uh, the youth? Uh, I'm empowering the youth by this, by changing their mindset. And it. Mm -hmm. You see, I'm not running away from the politics. Yeah. Please, I saw some tweets, people thinking I'm scared and yeah. everything. Like yeah. I mean, with an ego like this and a voice like this, I can't be scared. <laughs> I'm not scared of anything. <laughs> <laughs> get the wisdom in this mm. it's very important for me to be able to reach everyone mm -hmm. and it, yeah. because my drugs are not going to be the same so if we have things that can be the same can we have an artist that can un unite all the people mm. from all the sides so that you can be together 
Because honestly speaking, if you like a woman and you maybe a woman, you like a man, mm. are you going to start asking them with your party on a fire and Dave? No. No, no, no. You're just going to look at the figure and you like the figure and you take. <laughs> I just is real. So we can still exist. <laughs> You're killing me now. <laughs> Okay. Mm -hmm. We we still need. Yeah. And this could be the man who side. Mm -hmm. Please get that. Yeah. If, if, because just it in the data and it. Seven one 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 who won a data prize but no queer and let's learn to le to read these tweets properly. Yeah. Ndakata or something that he allow me to be there for everybody. Mm -hmm. That's what I'm trying to do. For everybody. For everybody. Mm -hmm. Eh. Hey. When you say allow me, who were you referring to? Who are you? Activists. Mm -hmm. Journalists lawyers and mm -hmm. everyone that mm -hmm. feels entitled to mm. their opinion mm. because we all do feel in, entitled to our opinion yeah yeah but then please for me mm -hmm. and for the sake of the children that you might be under this thing that's going on mm -hmm. all kinds of funny behaviors please allow me to lead the youth yeah and uh, to mm -hmm. talk about drugs mm -hmm. To talk about all these kinds of things that I have. Yeah, uh, we're going to talk about that uh, later on as well. Uh, the issue of drugs, you know, abuse. Uh, you're one of the, you know, artists who has stood out in advocating for the girl child, Holy Ten. Yes. How did that idea of representing and uh, fighting for the girl child come by? I'm going to be honest. Uh, it's not because <laughs> mm. it's because it's possible. Like, even if you listen to the song that I did with Wingy D, mm. there's a line that I said, mm -hmm. uh, I've been able to get that privilege under that situation. Mm. Yes. And it's mm -hmm. And then we are all under that one same environment. Mm. So that's what gave me the 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 idea to fight for the girl child. Because I'm like, it's possible mm -hmm. to go through this that we might be going through. And you don't have to be with my blessers. You don't have to. Those and that thing. Yeah. Not so that I can offend the girl child mm -hmm. for doing what she's doing. I understand there could be pressure that led you there. Yes. But please understand that it's possible to and exist. Do, do you think your work in advocating for the girl child is being had and taken into action? I I do. Mm -hmm. I do. I do believe that the same one and the muskans go and ramba chiro wa. Mwana e chiro akaro wa zoka da se ano ramba chizo kapamba. They they seem like they like trolling me, but they keep talking about me. Mm. Uh, they feel like they want to confine me in that message. Mm -hmm. So. You, yeah. So I But otherwise, I am trying to get your children out of drugs. Oh, okay. I am trying to get your children out of these behaviors. Mm -hmm. uh, but politics, please, mm -hmm. no. <laughs> You're not in politics. I'm not there. You're not into politics. Yes. Okay, there's a statement that uh, Mudiwa would posted on social media and it reads, I quote, uh, Holy Ten, Rambawaga Daru Echideki, you were the missing stone in the hip-hop. Uh, one who doesn't uh, just sing um, uh, sing money, uh, kanga namo chete, but one who also advocates for the girl child. I see you conquering Africa. Close quote. Uh, do you believe you were uh, the missing stone in the hip-hop? I do believe I was the missing stone in the music overall. Hip-hop is just... You know, it's a genre. Yes, yeah, it's one of those. Mm. But the music industry overall in Zimbabwe, they were waiting for me, and I am here mm -hmm. for the people. <laughs> yeah. Hey, I was also funny. Like, I was also funny, like self-raising it. No. When you say they were just waiting for you. Not even. If you if you want proof, Auntie, I'm here. Mm -hmm. I'm here. Test me if you have to. Yeah, we're gonna if get you have there. ways of testing. Exactly, we're going to get there yeah. very soon. So many ways. Mm. <laughs> so in the time that you have been uh, in the music industry, Holiton, particularly the hip-hop genre, yes. uh, what improvements or changes have you done? Uh, to the music industry? Yes. Um, we've brought um, a couple of artists onto the scene. Mm -hmm. Yes, uh, with the kind of knowledge that they need to have, especially around monetizing their work. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm going to talk about Saint Flo. Uh, that's the one that I've influenced directly. Mm -hmm. uh, Saint Flo, I brought him to the stable, and I also gave him time to pick what he wanted. Mm. Uh, uh, we didn't have anything that we signed. Uh, he picked what he wanted. Yeah. But I trained him, I coached him, my songs in mm -hmm. the club, mix and like a master. I even stopped my own music so I could focus, focus on Saint Flo. Mm. Because it's very important, at the end of the day, 
you gotta sing it like Jigga did. Mm -hmm. How many billionaires came out of my house? Mm. So I'm proud now. I'm watching Saint Flo, uh, Ashibukwa. You know he's taking care of his mom from mm -hmm. from the music. Yeah. And we had an influence there, and yeah, man, I'm good with that. And now I'm working on two more artists. Mm -hmm. Two more artists? Two more male artists and mm. one female artist. Mm -hmm. It's going to be crazy. So you don't have to disclose the names now? No, I, you know I do moves. Yeah? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, comparing, the, comparing the Zim hip hop genre with other countries like, uh, for example, South Africa, uh, in a scale of 10, how are we doing? Um, I don't understand the question. Like, they, and we have our Zim hip hop genre here in Zimbabwe. Yes. Yes. And uh, there are other countries like South Africa, you know, even like other uh, African countries, mm -hmm. which can be on a scale of 10, 10 out of 10, how are we doing? Are we doing well? Zero. Zero? Zero. 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 As far as hip hop is concerned, mm. that is the bitter truth. Well, what do you mean? Explain. Please explain. We'll Elaborate further on, on that. Go go try to say your name anyway. Mm. Say my name. Mm. And I act all untouchable. You go across a border. You don't Malawi. Malawi. No one knows. <laughs> anything about us. They don't know who is <laughs> who Walton is. Zero. So, so what's lacking? What, what's the problem there? You tell me. No, I'm asking you. You are the king of the I music. Am, I am the king. Yeah. Yes. So tell us. I'm asking the king now. What's lacking? Now that the king is not even recognized in South Africa. Yeah. What's wrong there? The king has not yet gone to South Africa to prove mm. himself. Mm. Why? Because the king's people are not with the king. But do you necessarily have to go to South Africa to prove that uh, you're the king? You or know, maybe South I mean, Africans, you going, know, going to South say, Africa is mm. not literally physically going to South Africa. Okay. You can send your music on yes. email. Yes. You have gone to South Africa. Mm -hmm. But my point is the king's people have not realized mm. that he is the king mm. and they are not with him. Okay. Do you know why I'm lazy to even explain anything? Because mm -hmm. in the moments where I needed the people, like I told you, rest in peace to, to Nathan. Mm -hmm. Uh, he is one of the only people that would be there. Every time I was trolled, Nathan would be there. JD mm. would be there. Mm. So in Nakashaya Simba, even in uh, the, the accusations that I was being given, mm. you know, people are going to be talking. Yeah. Simba Nakashaya wa regu ya kuzutra, uutsa na ngurira, uutsa na famba say, when I have to explain to that one person that yeah. would be there, mm -hmm. when no one else is. Where get that? Yeah. So the king's people, are not with the king. Mm. The king is consistently finding the need mm -hmm. to wake his people up. Mm -hmm. You think I'm stupid? Do you think I'll just tweet? I'm not sure. I'm not stupid. Mm. You've heard me talking. You've heard me rapping. Mm -hmm. But there's 700,000 views on that tweet. Mm -hmm. Simple. 700? Yes. And please expect my album on Friday. <laughs> what are some of the changes that you think uh, should be implemented in order to grow the music uh, industry in Zimbabwe? Slow down. Mm -hmm. and it, listen. Slow down. And I implore, I implore all of you, everyone that's in the media, mm -hmm. that's all the artists, that's the DJs, that's the everyone that's in the radio, everyone that has any data. Mm -hmm. and it, before mm -hmm. you comment, before you make an analysis, because there's a shoe that didn't take a because my man mm -hmm. slow down mm. take it easy and it, listen mm. read and it, interpret that's all I'm asking from the country mm. because you you consider us legends mm. that's the reason why it's not so truly after the chinsita buys yeah uh, so if you do consider us legends understand our wisdom mm -hmm. I won't go your brain very fast. Yeah. So understanding that take time. Mm. Yes. In the time um, uh, that you have been in the industry, you have been doing exceptionally well, Holy Ten. I must yes. say, uh, scooping awards left, right, and center, and we applaud you, you know, for that. Um, however, you seem to have uh, at, uh, this, you know, uh, attention-seeking syndrome, uh, according to people. You know, according to people, uh, or should we call it uh, freedom of speech? Uh, what's your take on this? You look like Toki Vibes. Should we call that f the, the freedom of God? <laughs> Toki Vibes? You do look like Toki Vibes. Mm. Like, you really do look like mm. Toki Vibes. Mm. So what happened there? Not, I, 
I've no idea. Same. Uh -huh. I don't. I also don't know what happened. You don't know what happened? Yeah. Okay. So, are you friends with a uh, fellow rapper, uh, Votes uh, JT? Who? Votes. What? <laughs> you have the audacity to ask me that. Yes, of course. I am friends with Votes JT. Yeah, you're friends. Yeah. Good friends. Good friends. Best friends. So there's no problem there. No problem. <laughs> Shout out Votes JT. Uh, <laughs> you collaborated uh, on the track how far uh was this before uh you separated uh you separate your ways i mean um yeah yeah you, you know i've always been that kind of a person that has to wear the crown yeah so when votes came through mm -hmm. i saw the talent mm -hmm. and i'm gonna say it be before the country the boy is very talented mm -hmm. very very talented yeah, and yeah, we helped him, mm -hmm. and well done. <laughs> Holy ten. <laughs> so, do you have anything against uh, each other? Yeah. What, what, what's that? We will never have peace. Mm -hmm. There will never be peace. Tell us more. There will never be peace between you and uh, yes, and the guy. For, yes, for yes, 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 yes. You at war. Magaturana be bit. What's wrong? I was. What's wrong? What's wrong? Hey. Yes. What really happened? They will never be peace. But what happened, never. Holy Ten? Tell us. I said they will never be peace. Yes, you. Yeah, that I end up on the path, but I want when to I, understand. You can't raise my temper to the level where I start venting. <laughs> yeah, I mean, that's not my thing. But they will never be peace. <laughs> okay. Mm -hmm. So you once tweeted, Thank you, votes. You know, for proving to the people that uh, you are still and always uh, be my son. I didn't, Close hear, court. I didn't hear that correctly. Okay, let me take the... Uh, okay, you said, uh, uh, thank you votes for proving to the people that you are still and will always be my son. Close court. Uh, what did you mean by that statement, uh, Wally Ten? Um, if you've come to me before like i have gone to certain people before yeah and i've acknowledged uh, their influence in my life mm -hmm. positive influence yes mm -hmm. if i do say that yeah in a, on a public platform then yeah. it's not wrong mm -hmm. yes so yes the son has said that he's a son mm -hmm. and the son will remain a son so you're the father i am the father <laughs> so ah uh, yeah no, no, no. the problem now uh, isn't is that uh, people uh, are the ones who are in a position are you not uh, positioning positioning yourself on top no the problem is mm -hmm. freedom and those are search back yeah you can decide to ignore what you want mm -hmm. that's why you can mute you can block people mm -hmm. uh, block mm -hmm. But mm -hmm. that's why we will come here and def de demand our flower. Yes. Yes. Yeah. Until you are saying Udama is holding. Jamaita is holding. <laughs> this is the best. Yeah. Yes. And you seem to be beefing with quite a number of uh, artists. Yes. Uh, probably do hip hop culture Is it real grudge uh, or what? Is it the culture? Probably not. Mm -hmm. But I guess it's the lack of that um, legislation, mm -hmm. uh, the lack of legal knowledge around the arts. Oh, yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes, which is a cause of concern, to be honest with you. Mm -hmm. uh, that's why artists end up crossing their lines. Because mm -hmm. maybe they don't understand the legal ramifications mm -hmm. of the things they can say mm -hmm. or the things they can do. So in the arts, it's lacking. Go to Zimura. Go to wherever. Mm -hmm. uh, they're not practicing in Jagannath. I've tried sending messages. I've tried talking to a lot of people yeah. around this whole thing. Mm -hmm. You ask some younger sounds right now. You yeah. talk to some younger. I'm the CEO. Mm -hmm. We have tax clearance. We have my artists. We have my my contracts that we're working on mm -hmm. to do things the proper way. So the reason why there's all this drama around the arts is mm -hmm. because we just don't know how to work around this thing mm -hmm. legally. Mm -hmm. Yeah. But then I could just come here and not know. Mm -hmm. So we need all these people that have this knowledge. Uh, that is me, number yep. one, and everyone else that feels like they have the knowledge mm. to help us to to elevate the arts. Yeah. Yes. At one point I heard it uh, talking about uh, intellectual property, and you seem to be yes. very well. I mean, you're well versed in that area. So maybe you can shed some light on that one. Yes. Let's talk to all these people that were saying Kutiawa mm -hmm. They are people that have law degrees, and 
what we're doing, the reason why I'm trying to exist in the balance is because I'm trying to be there for everyone. Yeah. And I'm trying to open an industry and a sector that has not been explored. Mm. There is money on the internet. You can monetize. You can do a lot of things. There mm. are graphic designers. Yes. There are lawyers, people that can govern intellectual property and music. Yaku, mm -hmm. yaku, rizwa music and it mm -hmm. those regards on the good or the identify or ugu gana ugu, oh, yeah. so that i can be able to help the people because mm -hmm. there's a lot of knowledge yeah. that we can give the people around the intellectual mm. property in t june 2021 20, you released a song uh violence as a response to enzo i shall uh, finish you know uh enzo i <laughs> Tell us about that. I will talk about Enzo Asho on another day. Mm -hmm. It was obvious. I got to tell you that. Shout out Enzo Asho. It's <laughs> obvious. I got to tell you. I got so far. No, but uh, I do. I mean, but the beef here. Yes, obvious. What's the beef? Beef that you repart the bagat bagona na Enzo. Beef. Both Enzo are good to him, but you know, yake uchirwa yago. But beef in the region. Enzo has to declare as the king of the Mhm. That is wrong. There is no proof. And it, uh, the legal system, you know, to uh, my adversaries, mm -hmm. adversarial system. But you can find out side in side. It's still a side deal. Look at Enzo Aisha as we hip hop. After Arabius does 45 albums, then what Enzo Aisha is the king. Saka Muguti Enzo Aisha or Dewechi. Zim Danzo or Dewechi. Zim Sungura. And so I shall answer him as you soon, my guy. Okay, so but you remember, Ziti guy, we were king of uh, Zim music, yes. So, uh, where's the proof? Because the ends are just joking of hip hop, uh, and a proof. Where's the proof? And a proof in the end between you, you and an origin. I mean, and an end, sorry, <laughs> you and an end, and uh, and a proof in the end. You would the king of what. And you repan about Africa suit. And repan about exactly. Yeah, and I say Enzo. Yeah, proof. He proof. Yeah. No, but you are banyaya so what you are doing. Yeah, king of Zim music. Exactly. But you are the king of Zim music, including Sungura, Nigi, and so on. And Enzo was doing yeah. the yeah. king of hip hop. Yeah. Then about I was going to go to banyaya mad visa disa. But you are going to decide. Exactly. So uh, why? Why? Proof you repan about Indonesia. Check that again. So you remember it when? Vrai ma phone, vrai ma tablet, vrai mm -hmm. ma laptop, ma computers, ma uh -huh. desktop, yes. Uh -huh. Check guys, you can tell me. Pindai ma streets, mm -hmm. pindai ma tax shop, pindai ma kombi. Kuti ndwe chibaba? Vunzai. Ah, well, then, nigga. So, uh, <laughs> you have done a number of collabs with uh, different artists, uh, yes. and, uh, you featured on Wiki D's uh, latest project, Eureka, Eureka, you know, on the song Ibozo. Yes. Uh, who approached who? On this uh, collab, uh, <laughs> like I told you, <laughs> uh, we are really that legally protected, and we have that legal knowledge. Mm -hmm. I can't even talk about that. Mm -hmm. I can't even mention anything around that. About uh, about the song, I can't. Why? You featured on the song for the sake of oh, all, for everyone. I can't, I can't talk about the song mm -hmm. about that specific. I can talk about the song, but that specific question. Oh, this one. Yeah. Okay. All right. No problem. But uh, how how was it working with? Uh, uh, Winky D, I mean, he's, uh, he's regarded as uh, the king in, uh, in music circles. Ah, it was wonderful. Mm -hmm. It was an honor, to be honest. Mm -hmm. Winky D, not only am I inspired by his, the length of his hair, mm -hmm. but I'm also inspired by the cadence. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. One or two interviews, mm -hmm. but then I'm inspired by that. Mm -hmm. You know, there's a way that he really keeps quiet when mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. when storms arise yeah that's that's nice mm -hmm. and he, he was always just the one probably listening mm -hmm. whilst we were talking oh yeah yeah he would let you do everything whilst mm -hmm. he was quiet mm -hmm. yeah so that's that's in and that's impressive i guess nice and yesterday you treated and i got activists yeah. journalists lawyers split opinions uh, will do not uh will not do any good uh, for a brand that is trying to save and save uh, everyone's um everyone so help me by not acting like a i have picked you know do not politicize a project that i have considered a mere honor to be part of uh i regret it now honestly close cut so 
Right, but they got Twitter is Jandy. A endo Zanga Zingua Zed, the Decatara to get it no muka. Mhm. A two. Do but it's a meditation. Yeah, and it is. No, you're a music, and it is. This is the deepest part of me. Mm-hmm. And this is the most important part of my life. Mm. And I'm at the peak, and all feeling in Zimbabwe, and it is. And it will push my works. Mhm. But I'm also conscious in a way of the environment and the atmosphere at here. Yeah. And it, just like we all have choices. In Dosagawa decide the suit you are going it's a very nice suit in Okay. Thank That's you. why you decided to wear a blue suit. Mm-hmm. He he decided to wear a black one. Mm-hmm. We have preferences and it, and sometimes my preferences are too fun. Uh, they just overwhelm mm-hmm. everything mm-hmm. to the level where maybe you cannot avoid it. Mm-hmm. But I go back, like I was saying, could it help me? I do understand could it's probably not possible to to stay but help me mm-hmm. so I can save your children. Mm-hmm. We get that. Yeah. So that someone doesn't see see my message as invalid. Just because Arkush Besa on political party and mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. the drugs mm-hmm. are the same. Mm-hmm. And it, you go back, my pets are going and your children will be equal mm-hmm. under those substances. Yeah. Allow me to be the one that everybody listens to. Mm. Please. Everybody was talking about it on Twitter yes, today. Yes, yes. People were saying, "Good, no, it's not. It's, it's not possible to stand in between." Yeah. The, it is. It is. Mm-hmm. If they can take the same drugs, and be in the same church, mm. be in the same nightclub, and and do the same thing, mm-hmm. then we can have an artist that everyone listens to. Please. Let so that when, when when you say I regret it, honestly, what were you referring to? I regret what activists, journalists, and every other person is turning into. I never attacked Wingy Day. Mm-hmm. Like I said, I maintain my respect. Yes. Yes. Mm-hmm. You really got to be vote JT for me. Because uh, on social media, I see, you know, uh, tr- being trolled. People saying, ah, Holy Ten, I uh, mean, uh, Wingy Day, something like that. After, you know, there's some sort of, you know, backlash. Uh, social media. So, may, when you said, uh, I regret it, honestly. Uh, you know, their narrative. I do. Mm-hmm. I actually do. Yeah. Because what I'm saying is why I would regret it. Mm-hmm. I would consider it an honor. But that honor, if it's going to divide my people, the same people that I fight for, yes. and it, the same people that I'm preaching to, then please, I mm-hmm. don't want the honor. Mm-hmm. Then what help mm-hmm. does it bring to mm-hmm. me? Mm-hmm. If that honor can unite the people and bring me everybody. And it, but mm-hmm. if you have a plan, mm-hmm. uh, Ola, yeah. and you want to do something and you have an agenda, yes. and you have soldiers, mm-hmm. and you realize and you realize that you need an army, Please tell your soldiers the whole plan. Mm-hmm. Please. So are you implying nah, that uh, you are not? I'm not implying you, you, anything. You are not told the, the whole you plan. Soldier? You are not a soldier. I'm not implying anything. I'm just saying if you ever become a soldier, it's like a proverb. Or if something. you ever become a soldier, mm-hmm. talk. Uh-huh. Yes. Yes. Please. Hold it in. Iba baba gap. Wa wa na kuto kagu skinyo amchan. Droga zovun. Urute re plan. And so, mm-hmm. uh, were you not uh, told the, the whole plan? Let's no, say, focus on the song. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, focus on the song only. Wait, what are we ruling about the song? We need to establish before we make the story. Mm-hmm. Uh, because you need to be honest with you. I can write verses in three minutes. Yeah. Which is what I can do. Mm-hmm. I can write a verse in three minutes. In three minutes. Disappoint me right now. Mm-hmm. I can write your this song mm-hmm. in fifteen minutes. Yeah. And it, mm-hmm. which is what can happen in music. Yeah. So mm-hmm. let's try to understand what in the Right. When I was a holy ten. Maganyora music. I think yeah. it's a I think personally I think it's a beautiful song. It's a good song. Then after you know, a big clash. Like people taking sides and whatnot. Is like I up a social media. I'm sure you are all aware of that. But Twitter uh, Then you know if you need, you know, uh, soldiers when you your certain agenda, people will misquote you again. So then you are clear to say song chat whether it's a good or it's a bad eh kwa uri wewe eh auna the the whole plan of the song the whole meaning 
Tekatasane this song It says Ruku Fungwa Newano Out there So that you clear the air You are the holy ten I have no air to clear I am the The people breathe The holy ten Holy ten I am the sensation And the influence of the people So when you realize that Don't trick me Mashogwango Pereva when you realize that the people I go there to my primary school mm -hmm. and the kids are saying holy, holy ten, ten. Mm -hmm. I go to high school, the kids are saying holy ten. Mm -hmm. I go to a and they are saying good holy ten mm -hmm. and it, because I speak the truth. Yeah. And uh, in uh, I mean in your own view, how do you interpret the song? How do I interpret the song? The song is good. Mm -hmm. It's a nice song. May I sing about blessers yep. and everything? Mm -hmm. It's a good song. We'll sing about blessers. Because mm -hmm. let me tell you this. What I'm saying, Kuti, you're not seeing both sides. Because let me tell you this, this proverb. Mm -hmm. No matter how thin you slice it, it's always going to have two yeah, sides. Yeah, yeah. So there's always going to be older people and there's always going to be younger people. Mm -hmm. So when you hear us talking about the context of blessers, please understand that we're the same people that are pushing for the youth to be successful. Yes, yes. Which means my youth, Achabata Mari, mm -hmm. and it is. responsible and careful that money, they can also become blessers. Mm -hmm. And it is. Yes, so whilst we're trying to push for the success of the people, we're trying to be there for everybody mm -hmm. and not to attack a certain group of people. Because Mangwana mm Tetinyara, -hmm. Nevedu. So that's what I'm saying. Allow me to preach to the youth. Yeah. Preach to my dad. And everybody. everyone, everybody. That's powerful, uh, Holiton. What's your message to those? I mean, who try and politicize almost, you know, uh, everything that you guys do as artists, not as Holiton, but as artists. You know, now today you release this thing, tomorrow you, re you release that, but then everything is just taken out of context and sometimes, you know, being politicized. You have to responsibly politicize these things. Mm -hmm. Yes, we're not saying we don't politicize. Kanapata or would he? Yes, when we have a message that we want to bring out or we have things that we need to do, mm -hmm. yes, when two or three are gathered mm -hmm. in my name, I'm with them. Mm -hmm. Even the Lord guarantees his support can upon a unit. Yeah. Don't sneak up on people. Mm. Okay. That's very powerful. Yes. Um, You wrote on your, term, uh, on your timeline, uh, Holiton, uh, you said, be careful with me, Ja Praiser. What was it about? Yeah, I'm, I'm trying to release among uh, my Afro beats and mm -hmm. now and then Liram Kati. Oh, yeah, it's too late. Could you have a plan against it? Because I'm going to be in the middle of the Dakariza. What are you saying? I'm going to be in the Dakariza. I'm going to be in the middle of the Dakariza. Ah, the guy's going to be as <laughs> <laughs> be careful. Okay. So I'm saying to mm -hmm. Okay. But do you think uh, you know you have to roll my when it comes to Mbira? Because Mbira not the bata can go. But not the bata. Uh, they are very good at it. Uh -huh. But uh, at the end of the day, uh, remember it's not about Kuti and we are as a uh, Yes, yes. We yes. are trying to vagarando uh, Exactly. So we are trying to move within that culture. Taka to end the same way. Yataka collaborate na. We did. Mm -hmm. It was because of that legacy. Yeah, yeah, yeah they've yeah. sustained it and they've kept it going for so long. Much I, I, I really respect the two of them for mm. everything they've done. Powerful. And uh, you're being uh, trolled on social media. Uh, you know, uh, people calling you all sorts of names. Which is the Uri Childish others saying Ah Uri Shumba Yep Anzi Yechi Yep Mechi Some are saying Hey Uri Guara. What do you have to say about it? Oh yeah. But social media, but I'm going to troll. You know. Yeah. yeah. Uh, when we probably had my opinions mm -hmm. about people that are more important in their life. Yeah. You got to touch through your lifetime. Yeah. Or your sister. Yeah. And those are people that are more important mm -hmm. than me yeah. in your life. Mm -hmm. So you've been entitled to that opinion. So it can affect me knowing that you have to be a Ah, powerful. And uh, there is one controversial self proclaimed uh, prophet, uh, Jay Israel, you know, who had uh, this to say about you. So he said, Very soon we are going to be giving out a list of uh, the musicians who are a part, you know, of the, cl of the cult. Uh, it's very disappointing to know that uh, there are musicians who go for power, uh, who go for rituals, uh, just to come and, uh, eh, uh, you know, 
use the and the use those uh, rituals online to gain popularity and to gain attention uh, to sell their music probably to my zimbabwean brothers one of the people that i actually uh, saw in one of uh, these cults is holy 10. there is a guy called holy 10 from zimbabwe a holy 10 very young guy i was very disappointed when i saw that uh, he is one of the guys who is also going to these sangomas uh, going to these uh, traditional healers just to look for power just to look for whatever uh, so that uh, they can go around and have um but um, anyway soon it is going to be uh, it is going to come out. Uh, wait for it. It's coming. Close court. What do you make of this? Uh, you know, statement. Yeah, Prophet J. Israel. Uh, like I said uh, earlier, good everyone is entitled to their opinion. Because that's the problem. Mm. But I don't blame him. Yeah, it's cool. Trigu pizza. The trigu pizza. Ah. But then, like I said, allow yourself to be tested. Mm. I want you to test me mm -hmm. if you want. Mm -hmm. If you want me to show you my distribution platforms and Neymar mm -hmm. tens, mm -hmm. a music, yedu, Neymar brands that you know Shanda now, mm. and how smart we have monetized this work. Mm. You see, when I then do look for Saint Flo, Michael Mags, and everyone else that I want to put under some younger sounds, mm. I'm saying, good, we are money. What's possible mm. here? So I do understand could you can have explained it that they're entitled to yeah, the opinion. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But yeah, can I go and wait there and mad that Nazo? Mugati two million man number Zao at Peo. Not three. Or mega. Peo. Well, it did. Yeah, genius. Thank you so much. Yeah, yeah, I have to say this. And uh, we have seen you on uh, social media uh, posting intimate pictures with your girlfriend, Kimberly. How did you guys meet? Uh, with Kimberly. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, you know, Kimberly was a model mm -hmm. and she was famous at Use It. Yeah. Yeah. And I saw her on some videos mm -hmm. she, with the work that she was doing. Yeah. Uh, so I, I really did take time into discovering the kind of person that she was mm -hmm. until that's so right. That's going on to her. <laughs> so how long have you been dating? Yeah, uh, we've been dating since. Uh, when did you guys start stalking my girlfriend? I think probably February. March. 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 In February. March. February. Yeah. March. Yeah. Wow, so close to a year now. Mm -hmm. And uh, on here, birthday you posted uh, an, a cut. You say time to make babies. Yeah. Yeah. To tell some chat with about holy time. Ah, definitely. <laughs> when? I when? 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 <laughs> no, I'll tell you. you I, I, <laughs> <laughs> As a teacher, enjoy. Teacher, enjoy. Yeah. Nah, so nah. let us see pictures of her, of your girlfriend. You know, trended on uh, on social media with a man uh, at a local hotel in room yeah. three or three. And I forgot to say, but my songs, you know, with yeah. some other people, you know. Yeah. Uh, but pe people in, in, I mean, insinuated uh, that was um, in an affair with that particular man. Uh, what do you make of this? Do you agree with uh, what people were saying, or maybe you were, they were just you not know, jealous? Well. You know, I was actually talking to my lawyer yesterday, mm. and she was trying to guide me towards this phase that we're in yeah. where I'm training. Yes. And, mm -hmm. and I was telling her, Guti, that thing about the 302. Mm. We could have sued. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because it didn't actually happen. Ah, it never happened. That's what I'm saying, Guti. Legal action, even against the hotel, because mm. they ended up marketing. Yeah. And all these other corporates that it was for me it was like these people are really mm. dumb to be honest no one took time that's why right now this mm -hmm. every time you clear kind of any public yeah. speculation because mm -hmm. when i expected the people to be there for me mm. there's a sure there's a sure way because i actually have the the full story yeah can you imagine hey hey, hey. men of god yeah saviors mm. of the people ended mm. up doing that. but trust me it's, it's not even true. <laughs> it wasn't even true, guys. 302. Hey. But then we have no one to prove it. Mm -hmm. I was too busy trying to comfort my girlfriend because mm -hmm. she was crying. and <laughs> It's shame. They brought shame upon the girl. Mm. And I was right there next to her and I had to. And uh, Passion Java went on to this, uh, this song uh, about uh, Room 302. You mm -hmm. listened to it? I did. Yeah. What is your response to this song of, of Passion Java? Well, he did then go on air and clear it and say, Goody, 
Nah, it's just music. It's just music. So I can't respond to it since he said good. It was just music. It's just music. Yeah. Ah, so that's fine. So are you in good books now with uh, Java? I'm not in any books with Java. Not in any books? Yes. Why, 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 my guy? I'm not in good books or bad books. Or bad books. Yeah. But you not guys, in any books. Do you guys talk? No. You don't talk? We don't talk. We don't have to. Wow. <laughs> do you talk to everybody? No, I'm asking you. I don't talk to Passion Mhm. All right. You are releasing an album, uh, The Book of Malak. The Book of Malakai. In Malakai, yeah? Yes. Uh, that consists of uh, you know, 10 tracks and a collab with a Ghanaian artist. And a South African duo. South African Jewel. Oh, Jewel. Yeah. Wow. So tell us about uh, the album. Uh, what do you have in store for us? You know, what should we expect uh, from the album? Uh, we have manifestations of what we never thought we'd see on the ground. Mm, mm. Yes. The, you, when you listen to the album, you realize could uh, some of the songs that I've written there. Mm. After that was oh. Yes. So especially in terms of things like betrayal, mm -hmm. uh, backbiting. Yeah cheating, mm -hmm. lying, and faithfulness, mm -hmm. and all those, mm -hmm. deception, and everything. Yeah. I sang about that, and that's been the book of Malachi, because mm -hmm. the book of Malachi is the book before the New Testament, yeah. before Jesus Christ comes in, that's mm. the last book. Uh, it's talking about all those things, about what God will do when he comes through. Mm -hmm. But it's really talking much about unfaithfulness, but how you could really have someone on God to trust from a Twitter stream, yeah. and it could really just be a problematic relationship it could mm. be a wife it mm. could be a husband it could be anybody so do you say you've been are you saying you've been betrayed i've been betrayed every single day bro even when i thought it had stopped mm. yeah i've been betrayed people she don't did? people don't tell you the truth mm. that's just the absolute truth they don't tell you the truth yes the people the person standing or sitting right next to you if you're listening to me will not tell you the truth but you know holy ten yeah, I understand. I can't wait for this album. But uh, from the way you are, you're talking, you know, I can tell. Maybe, I, I, if I may ask, are you bitter? I am always bitter. Why? A lot has happened and a lot keeps happening. Mm. Yes, I am bitter. Very. I am very bitter. So how are you going to, you know, to I'm resolve gonna rap. it? I'm going to keep rapping. Keep rapping. Yeah, that's how I can That's write, a remedy. That's, that's how I can write a song in three minutes. Mm. Uh, a very big song. But it's not because I'm very talented or because of, I have so much that I keep. Mm -hmm. In that maturity, actually, I'm really holding that yeah, maturity. Yeah, I have yeah. it. Mm -hmm. Trust me, I have it. Mm. When I tweet, I know what I'm doing. Whereas you can keep so much inside. Yeah. You have to find an outlet. And for me, it's always been about the music. Mm. That's why I'm unapologetic about my actions. Because yeah. every time that I rapped, I was rapping about something. Mm. What's your message to Winky D? I know he's listening. Winky D, if you are listening, thank you so much. Uh, for putting me on your album it's been as a, a person that's so celebrated by the people thank you so much it means so much uh for the milestone that you have given us mm. as, as, as the, as the youth. <laughs> <laughs> yeah go well down and you gave a superb performance at uh, the hicc Did I? I like the uh, i like your performance um hey and especially when you performed that um loss yeah, hey, by Nick yeah, yeah. you guys, how did you come up with that? I mean, uh, that song. Yeah, I'm gonna also tell you something about yeah. me. What I'm gonna be doing 2023, mm. I'm gonna be writing songs. Yeah, yes, because I feel like I have that guidance that I can give. Mm -hmm. uh, Los uh, Nicky Genius, I a song, you got it. Yeah, yeah, I tell you, this is dope, mm. but mm. I'm gonna hit mm. mm. And then I heard the sample, you lost. Yeah, it's like this is what I'm talking exactly. about. Exactly, let me guide through this thing. So I guided through the, the beat, the mm -hmm. lyrics, and everything. Mm. Uh, and just like all the other songs, and uh, Marisa, mm -hmm. I guided through. Yeah. Even Feli Nandi, mm -hmm. I wrote the whole song because yeah. I'm always trying to make you listen to what's playing mm. in my head. Mm. So that's what I'm doing this year for the Summer Younger songs, guys. Wow, I'm writing the song. That's cool. Ah, that's holy ten for you. So maybe on oh, another from a distance. Yeah. So that when you're so understand. Also, push your number. And did you Also, and also what I do. That's holy ten for you guys. Ah, oh my God. So uh, holy ten. Uh, your parting remarks. Uh, on Friday, in six p.m. 6 p.m. We're, we're going to open the book of Malachi. Mm -hmm. We are going to read through the scriptures. 6 p.m. 6 p.m. Mm -hmm. on Friday. 
Yeah. There is wisdom that I've put in that book. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Is it on YouTube? Is it? Uh, it's going to be on YouTube and every other digital platform. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. It's even going to be on WhatsApp mm. everywhere. Mm. But the book <laughs> will be opened mm-hmm. and the book will be read. Wow. By the people. By the people. And how can people get in touch with you, uh, Holy Time? People cannot get in touch with me. Mm. They can't. I'm good. I'm okay. Listen to the music. <laughs> yeah, you said you're bitter. <laughs> I won't be surprised. Don't get in touch with you. So, yeah. Oh, even they want to follow you? Yeah, yeah. It's, it's Instagram, Facebook, and everything like that. It's like Holy 10. Holy 10. Mm-hmm. Or Famba Maastricht. Tere Rama Bluetooth speaker. Holy 10. Holy 10. Chimbote Poma Buzz, Bichana, before you go. All right. I'm going to give you a Zim Dance or track. <laughs> Why Zim Dance or track? Because <laughs> there's a Zim Dance or track on the on the, oh, on the, the new album. album yeah. Wow. Candy Gate, how do you want to candy gate? Me not sleepy, how do you want to pump bed? Me young bread, uneka guteta. Candy Gate, how do you want to candy gate? Candy Gate, how do you want to candy gate? Me not sleepy, how do you want to pump bed? Me young bread. Uneka guteta. Uneka guteta. I jump from the chicha to our But anyways, koko koko hip hop. Apa nzo nzo ere. Anda anda sinzo sawa kubaja vunza. Uneka guteta. Chuma ni koko hip hop one. Ah, ma gute liki sira masi. No no, tuko liki sira. Even even sira ba album. No no no. Even sira ba album. That kind of a guy, anu gute liki sira album before a Buddha. But then I, this is not the time. Oh, this is not the time. It's very proper gute monsu kisa ba na album gute vunza and everything. Yes, but not you. And <laughs> not me. <laughs> but why, Holy? <laughs> yeah, but then my non fan of Tango was going to be a little bit. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. <laughs> that was Holy 10 for you guys. Okay, I enjoyed this one. Okay. Uh, so, yeah, to know the Holy 10, you have a program going on the spot. And uh, yeah, many thanks to the people watching on Facebook and also listening on radio. Uh, to know the Holy 10, my name is Owen. We're coming on to all of seven, the Chief A. Marshall. And uh, many thanks to the crew behind the scenes. That's Loud uh, Mike, Loud 5, Mushun, the guy behind the cameras, and uh, producer Nyinga. Dingana. You can follow me on Instagram at DJ Ola7 as well as my Facebook page at DJ Ola7 and, uh, and DJ Ola7 style from right and uh, my Twitter handle at DJ Ola underscore 7. Don't forget to subscribe to the YouTube at Star FM Zimbabwe and also DJ Ola. Kwanas, bye bye. After drive. After drive.